Hello, my beautiful star seed. This is Mara Haru back again talking about breaking those chains of deception. Hey, following my instinct, I took my shoes off and my socks off and I stood on the soil of earth. Earth has so much to offer us that we don't even recognize. And I say that because when I do that, I feel a connection, like something just go all through my body. It's like energizing. It's like when you take a plug and you want to cut a light on in your bedroom, in your bedroom, in the room of the house. When you stick it in there, when those wires connect, the cold and the, the cold and the hot, bam! Light like this. Information begin to come from everywhere. You are the same way. The positive and the negative. When it connects. It brings light. It brings knowledge. It brings information. It brings more about the ability to be able to, ooh, I forgot to hug my star seeds. Mm -mm. Sending you hugs and kisses. I can't go without doing that because you are me and I am you. Whether dark or light, you are me and I am you. Now, back to what I was trying to say. Um, it's like, our intuition, that's our higher self. Our higher self is actually intuition that we listen to sometimes, we listen to sometimes we don't. Now, it's just like intuition helps you to read minds. You read minds all the day whether you realize or not. Let me give you an example. You're driving down the street. We got a traffic light. The traffic light says red, stop, green, go. Yellow means wait or yield, right? Okay, so we're taught to follow the traffic light signals. But guess what? Just because it says that doesn't mean everybody's going to follow that. And that's where you step in. Your instincts tell you, oh, Lord, I don't think he's going to stop. That light is red and he is still coming. Let me get out of the way. The traffic light didn't tell you that. Your instincts told you that because we are all connected. Believe it or not, red, yellow, purple, black, and white. I ever have seen. I have even seen dogs cross the street. Okay, his instinct told him, "You better wait. <laughs> you better wait." So I'm saying, let's heighten our instincts, of instinctive abilities. And one of the ways it can be done. There's many ways, but one of the ways it can be done is to go outside, take your shoes off. Our shoes separate us from earth it does it separate us from earth so if you can go to the park take your shoes off take your socks off and just connect just connect and you'll feel the energy from the earth begin to flow from your feet all through your bodies all up to your pineal gland in your brain and just sit there and connect and receive information from Mother Earth. I'm telling you, I did that this morning and it just so did something for me. You begin to feel and hear the birds far in the distance. And you feel silence and peacefulness. And then you feel like doing this. And just be. Just be. Really, there's nothing else around you that really matters than just being and flow with the vibrations in the universe. Now you see, I hadn't planned on doing that, but my instinct had me to do that. Someone needed that. And I'm glad to be able to give that. So take time when you can and go outside 
take your socks and your shoes off and plant your feet, which, is, which are your roots, into the universe and continue to grow. He's loving you with the love of the universe. Bye-bye, my beautiful, beautiful star seeds. Mwah, 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 mwah.